Penis. Penis. That's uh, I knew you were gonna bring that. <laughs> yeah, I had to. I told the guy I'd bring it, bring it along. We're trying to get his fuel filter out. It's probably oh, Brad Paisley sings us. Yeah. He doesn't even hunt. And he sings a song about camouflage. <laughs> yeah. Like his song there, um, Alcohol? Yeah. He doesn't even, never drank an alcoholic beverage in his life. He <laughs> sings a song about alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> I to try to get his fuel filter off. It's probably original equipment since 94. The truck's only got, what, 140,000 miles on it? Yeah. So, probably never been changed if it has, maybe once. <laughs> But yeah, I'm gonna try to get in the piece there on the line and see if there's any rust in there. Maybe there's some debris holding the clip up to pop it off because I couldn't get it off. But yeah. Howdy. Say so this is Redneck U and we're Deckard. Oh, <laughs> uh, this is Redneck U and that's Deckard. <laughs> oh, shit. Alright. Safety goggles, those are overrated until you poke an eye out. We got this tool, you got these dicks that stick out, it goes inside that fitting, you gotta pull the line in and it'll unhook your teeth, and we can't get it, but we want to give her hell, but I figured I'd show you guys what's going on, what we're trying to do, but stay tuned to the next part, we're still dickered. <laughs> okay, we're still dicked, the tool that he's got, the lips are too big to fit in there, so we're gonna cut the fucking filter right there so we can bend the line down. We get like two screwdrivers in there to pry the teeth open and pull what's left of the filter line off. And that's what our plan is. I think he's you can get a small enough tool that'll fit in there. I see ya. Yes, the people already watch my channel already know about fuel filters, but that little lip right there is what's inside you're holding this up with the teeth yeah we're gonna cut that out and hopefully pop it right out the new plastic clips original equipment steel hold it right there but yeah that's what we're up to talk to you in the next step or whatever alright well Trim this. Oh, I don't need camera shy. Trim her, started cutting on it with the hacksaw there. Just let it drain out and break it the rest of the way off, cut it the rest of the way off, whatever. Don't wear eco tree hugging douchebags. I'm dripping it in the pan, so fuck you. Next step. Oh, fuck me, running. It's, it's cold as crank. We got it cut off. There's two fingers in there. It is the same day that I put, or it's negative six. No, I'm taping, but battery's going dead. Fucking, yeah, cut it off. I just got the tool tabs in there. Do the same thing for that side. And be done. Oh, I can't tell if you see it, but. That's how we're doing it. We might have to cut a wire nut up and do it, but yeah. <laughs> Fucking, uh, yeah. Probably the battery's gonna die, so this is the last of this. <laughs> Fucking need this plane on my leg. It's only about six degrees out, and I've got to hold these fucking jeans on my own. <laughs> it is about six degrees. What is Six to eight. Yeah, it's only fucking ten out. Literally. <laughs> but yeah, I'll it's shut the really fuck up. Oh, shut oh, the. Disappear. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. It's dicked. Dickered. I too cold to fucking operate it. <laughs> Probably. I don't know. That's how we're doing. Battery's gonna. Alright. I have revived the battery. But we sacrificed an empty Copenhagen can lid. 
to make a tool that will uh, fit over that lip. So when we push it in there, it'll go over that lip. These are those teeth we got there out with the wire on the other one. We're trying to do this, make it a little bit easier on us. But yeah, these fuckers clamp on that lip. And that's what holds your gas line in there. We'll just get this fucker around and hopefully like hell it'll work and pop the other one out. But I'll go before my battery dies. Oh, fucking give her. Now we're cooking in oil. Our damn deal didn't work. I'm recording now. <laughs> Yes, everyone. It's only like fucking zero out, literally. This is cold. Freaking bundled up like the bottom of snowman. This is fucked. <laughs> you need a temperature reader out here, Enos. What's up? You need a temperature reader out here. You don't need a temperature to know it's cold. <laughs> I know it looks like you're fucking running a V8 under there with your breath. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious, dude. It's zero, Al. It's I put money on it. I put money it's fucking below zero. Maybe, if there was a wind chill. Oh, crank. Well, we only got that one last clip to fucking put out and put the new one on. Just got about nine gallons of gas. Oh, fucking look at this shit. Zero out. Got a hole. Zero out. Got a hole. Quit bragging there, tough guy. <laughs> tough guy. I'm a fucking dumb guy. Go to a fucking gunfight with a knife. I usually just bring a spear. You ain't got rid of that leaf spring yet? That's how we left. <laughs> Sitting in the corner. I use it when I play hockey so the fucker ball doesn't go underneath the damn table shot. You didn't even take the one back you bought. <laughs> I'm fixing all the buggies. Shaking like a dog shitting razor blades here. I hate to wipe your ass on. <laughs> You said you washed this the other day. It did. <laughs> Let it snow. <laughs> Ain't my fault this winter time. <sighs> well, we got those out. Those things right there is what holds your shit in. Got some carb cleaner. Got squared it in there. Clean it out. Clean them out a little bit. It's pretty dang dirty. But yeah, then just slap our filter in there. Set these fucking clips in there. Cause that little notch holds it in there, and we're done. Thanks for watching. This is Ingers's Dickard ride, and how you doing? I can't even see you. There you are. Dickard, man. But yeah, thanks for watching. We'll be back on another date and time. <laughs> and remember, Copenhagen cans can be used as tools. <laughs> Later. Well, changed a fuel filter, fired it up. But it's still doing like this pulsating. If you guys can hear it. It's being weird like that. Yeah, it's got some shit in the line, taking a minute or so to clean it out or something. Maybe you guys that have F-150s or whatever, 94, around that era, this body style. If you ever had this problem, let me know.
I just, I don't know. Can't yeah, see in there. These guys are, are asleep. This had to tighten up the new bolt there. Huh. Don't know why. It's a 300 straight six, four nine liter. Yeah, if you, any of you guys ever run across this problem, let me know. But thanks for watching. I'll talk to you later.